That's the question at the end. It's not whether you simply used his name when it was beneficial for you and started loving the gifts that he gave because there was this motive in your heart toward these surface level distinctions. It's did God really know you? And it's not, you're not gonna figure that out by simply doing external things or having a list of things that you do or a list of things that you don't. Because, here's the scary part of the text, it is not always obvious. If these people are in or out, it's not obvious. It's not obvious on the outside. Now, here's what I mean. I'll give you an illustration. Uh, So some of you know Screamo. Have you ever heard of Screamo music? All right, scream on music, okay? There's this music. It sounds like this. That's how it sounds. Now, if you, if some of you walked into a room, all right, and you heard scream music, you would say, that's us from the devil right there. That is leading the kids astray. This is the problem. That stuff is corrupt. It's from the pit because it's, it's, it's like uh, Metallica. You know, something like that, all right? Madonna. All right, so something like that, okay? You'd be like, that music's evil. Now, here's the problem. You walk in a room a few minutes later and your kids are watching an episode of Friends and you sit down and laugh it up. No big deal. You realize all your, you're you're, you're shallow. You're not, you're naive. You're not thinking deeply about what's happening in those moments. You are simply hearing the rah, and you think, oh, evil. You stand and watch friends. You have a few laughs. Here's what Neil Postman said. Our culture is amusing ourselves to death. See, the problem is you can laugh yourself into a state of soul death because the worldview that is being pummeled by friends to our culture is just as destructive as Screamo, maybe more, but you're laughing your way through it. These things are not obvious. You got to look underneath, man. Look holistically at what is happening in a worldview, in an idea, not about how it makes you feel. See, here's the problem with these guys. These guys, they're emotionally, they love this stuff. All right? They're having experiences. They love going to the retreats and having mountaintop. They love how it makes them feel. They love being part of a community. They love hanging out with people. They love having traditions. They love these things, but they don't know him. 